Hairliners Beauty Salon has been making Harrisburgians look and feel their best for more than 30 years. And it, it, it's been good. The salon's owner, Reginald Haywood, says part of staying afloat as a small family-owned business is the ability to adapt. Well, we've been through a lot of different decades, you know, the uh, 80s, 90s, and uh, 2000. So we had to learn to adapt and uh, grow and change with our environments, which we did. And that's tend to help us stay in business and to keep ourselves relevant and current. When the pandemic hit, hair salons were forced to shut down across central PA. Haywood once again had to get creative to stay in business. Well, one of the things I had to do uh, with, with the pandemic, I had to uh, pivot. And I would see my wife getting up every morning and she would be on Zoom. She would be Zooming. You know, she had had Zoom meetings, meeting after meeting. And I was watching the frustration. She would get up some morning to get up and she had to fix her hair and all this kind of stuff. And I said, well, you know what, that's, a, that's an idea, you know. So what I did, I started thinking about, you know, women have to get on uh, the meeting. They had to get on Zoom every day. I could do something with maybe wigs. Along with selling custom cut and colored wigs, Haywood began scheduling his clients private salon time so they could continue to social distance. Haywood says as his way of saying thank you to the community for supporting him and his family all these years, he makes it a point to mentor young hairstylists in the Harrisburg community. He's proud to give young Central Pennsylvania stylists their first job at his salon, some of which now even own their own salons. You know, because I think being a business person is something that you should cherish. For Proudly Pennsylvania, I'm Jesse McDonough.